In this video, I will be sharing a very underrated gaming gem with less than 15 million market cap, with an amazing team, with a lot of pumpamentals, a huge community, not on a tier 1, and I will be using this cheat sheet, which is also downloadable in my Patreon Discord. So, want to join a community, don't want to lone wolf this bull run, but actually want to see what other people are thinking about a certain project, or do you want portfolio reviews or buy alerts, sell alerts, and the secret gems? Well guys, I started this Patreon two weeks ago. We already made a lot of access, and for $25 a month, you can join us. But the gem I was talking about is Lit Lab Games. And I already made a video about it, but guys, this one is consolidating for such a long time. It's only 9 million in market cap, 3 billion in max supply. And as you can see, the only decent exchange you can get lit is Maxi and BitGet. I prefer to use Maxi, so... And as you can see, it pumped a lot in November. Last month, it's going sideways. And <laughs> there are a lot of people fudding, thinking it's a scam because it hasn't moved for months. So this is actually very normal. People calling this a scam shouldn't invest in crypto because this looks actually very healthy. Okay, it's forming a downtrend. It's normal, okay? It pumped significantly. It's holding strong on this support here. Let's see if it's going to hold strong because uh, if it's breaking through this low, I think that we can go much lower than that. Anyway, I don't think it's going down. Um, this could actually explode anytime. And that's why I am making this video. For my cheat sheet, this is what I'm actually using when I found a gem or a project which I'm very interested in. And of course, you have to filter your cryptos because before throwing your money into a project, you want to know who's behind it. Is there any hype around it? How is the token distribution? Uh, do they have a roadmap? Do they have milestones? Um, is there any liquidity? So yeah, guys, this cheat sheet, it's downloadable in the Discord, like I said. And uh, yeah, let's dive into it. So LitLab Games, let's take a look at the team because a team means trust and credibility. Let's take a look at their website. I like the website, it's very clean, uh, it's like how a, how a gaming site should look like. So the partners, BNB Chain, Cedify, Dex Tools, one month ago they got partnered by Chainlink. Uh, everything looks very bullish. I forgot to mention that this is a very new project, hence why it's so low in market cap. But I think when they will list on other exchanges, there will be flowing so much money into it. Because guys, there's already a huge community behind it. So I actually found the team in the white paper. The team doesn't have to be always on the site, okay? So when you don't find a team on the site, it's not necessarily not doxed, okay? I recommend to just search for the team on Google and if you can't find it, well, it's probably not doxed. But this, uh, but here you can see the Lit Lab Games team. Daniel Shatko, CEO and founder, former esports player and coach. LitLab Games actually also hold esports tournaments and yeah, of course, what is better than a ex-esports player and coach to be the CEO of your project? And also Javier, um, this one I saw him on the AMA, I think on Archie's channel, I'm not sure, but the team seems very passionate and there are a lot of things coming in the future, so you are so early, you are still early and a 9 million market cap. Man, I don't even understand. Well, it's probably that low because it's only on Maxi and BitCat. That, that's probably the only reason. So this looks very well. No tier 1 exchange. Well, we know it's only on a Maxi and BitCat. So this checks the boxes also. 3. Token distribution. Examine how tokens are distributed. A fair and transparent distribution model is essential for avoiding centralization and manipulation. And avoid sell and buy taxes and honeypots check on dex tools so let's check dex tools for a bit i'm actually certain that they haven't a honeypot and also no buy and sell taxes but i'm just going to show you guys so yeah this looks very clean okay yeah sell tax maybe 0 0.01 but look guys if this is a honeypot and the buy tax is like five percent sell tax five percent you just want to stay away so yeah, everything looks very, very good at LitLab Games. So let's take a look at the tokenomics. 
This is how the lit token ins issuance will remain for the next years with a total supply of 3 billion tokens. So 11% in in-game rewards, farming 14%. Team 14%. So they are quite transparent. This is what you want to see, right? Uh, this is not a shady project. So these tokenomics are allocated pretty well. So here you can take a look at the token vesting. So after 63 months, everything will be released. So here you can see the token distribution. Again, very transparent, very clean. So yeah, the tokenomics, token vesting, everything is showcased very well. This is something you want to see. So let's get back to the roadmap and milestones. We are looking at the white paper, which is showcasing the roadmap also. So page 10. LitLab Games goal begins with Cyber Titans, but goes far beyond a single game. If you didn't know, uh, they are also the publisher of Cyber Titans, which is downloadable on your phone. And as you can see, well, in the fourth quarter of 23, mobile version release. So yeah, they achieved everything. So yeah, let's see what they uh, are bringing to the table in 2024. So everything is very clear with LitLab Games. The volume and liquidity, yeah, there's decent volume. You know, it's, it's not zero. Uh, we all know that this isn't a rug. So yeah, but if you didn't know, uh, there are many factors around the volume. Uh, for example... If it's in a downtrend heavily and you see that the volume is cooling off, that means the sellers stopped selling, you know? But a very high volume could also be bullish in a bull trend. That means the buyers are buying. And so are many factors you have to take into consideration that it's not all black or white. And six, community, check the socials if there is any hype or community behind it. I know because I'm invested into Lit Lab Games that there's a lot of hype, a lot of engagement. There's a huge community behind it because they hold also tournaments. So let's take a look at their X. I always say Twitter, but I should learn to say X. So they have 45k followers. 2023 was massive. A lot of milestones were hit both in Lit Lab Games and in Cyber Titans game references. So you can see what they are up to. Look at this. This is not just a shady project. This is a very, very underrated gaming project. There are tournaments, people are playing, people are wearing Cyber Titan shirts. Man, it's bullish. It's very bullish. Look at this. So yeah, this is Cyber Titans. compete now yeah man it looks very nice lit lab games um so it's still on a three cents i actually uh have been accumulating below the four cents because it's still a buy it's like black friday man i'm i'm i think if this one was on a kucoin this one had already like 50 million market cap because there are a lot of trash projects even in the bull market projects like ufo gaming went to a billion so if this one will go to a 1 billion, that'll be a 100x. Without taking the tokenomics into consideration, obviously there will be some inflation. I mean, a lot of inflation, but guys, uh, we are here to make money and we won't hold longer than two years, okay? Because I see a lot of people, man, I'm going to hold this coin for three, four years. Then I'm saying like, okay, you're investing in crypto, but don't you have any knowledge about cycles? the four year cycles, the Bitcoin halving cycles. I mean, what's the point in holding for three or four years? Just get in before the halving, invest, hold. I don't care what you do, swing trade. Um, just don't be the one left holding the bags because you want to hold it for two, three, four years. I don't understand it, guys. So before you invest in crypto, man, just gather some knowledge, four year halvings, the four year cycles, because there will be an all-time high, new all-time highs. But most of the cryptos, they will go back to where they came from. 90-90%. So there's no point in holding it. What I do is, I'm putting my money into high potential low caps. When I make like a 10x, a 5x, I flip it. But it depends on what project. How do, you, how do I see it in the long term? But most of the low caps are just get a quick x. 
and flip it into higher conviction bags like for me it's Caspa. I haven't packed my bags for Caspa yet. I am planning to make multiple axes with my low cap plays and the profits will go into Caspa. Caspa is a long term steady growing asset. Where can I see lit lab games? I can see do it 100x but I'm trying to stay conservative always when I invest my money because what if it's going to hit a 90x and I'm waiting for the 100x I will be left holding the bags. So take your profit at 5x, 10x, 15x, 20x and just keep a moon bag. So yeah guys, this cheat sheet has come to an end. If you want to join my Patreon, you are very welcome. And Lit Lab Games, I'm still accumulating. And I thought I'd share this with my subscribers because if you're looking for a gaming project which hasn't been really really pumping the last few weeks or months lit lab games is on a very nice buying opportunity no financial advice thank you for watching hit the like buttons and i see you guys in the next one